Hi, I'm Allison and I'm a speech therapist. Hi, I'm Jen and I'm an occupational therapist. Here are some general tips for kids who are picky eaters. First, make sure your child is always seated to eat. When your child is seated, it's important that they sit at 90, 90, 90. 90 degrees at their waist, 90 degrees at their knee, and 90 degrees with their ankles. And the tabletop should come to elbow height. If your child is a picky eater, it's important to talk to a doctor to make sure it's not due to a medical problem. And also talk to a speech therapist to make sure it's not due to a problem with chewing skills. Sitting together for a family meal is really important for the child to see you eating as well. We know sitting at a table with a child with special needs can be super challenging. One way to start doing that would be to sit at the table with the child for preferred activity, coloring, stickers, for a short amount of time. Typically a child won't sit for a meal if they've been snacking all day because they're not hungry. We would suggest that you limit snacks to several times a day um, so the child is hungry and will be able to sit with you during a meal time. And we also think about sensory. When you think about sensory with eating, that has to do with the look of the food, the smell of the food, and the touch of the food. So if your child is afraid of trying new foods, you might try introducing new foods that look like foods they already like. For example, you could work with brown sticks. All foods that are brown, all with the same shape. So if your child likes pretzels, you could introduce other foods that are brown and stick shaped like pretzels. Make sure the portions are small. For example, macaroni and cheese, one noodle. Another general tip for children who might be picky eaters is to make sure you're giving them a chance to try to develop new skills. If your child is still on a sippy cup or a bottle, they can't learn a new skill unless they have a chance to try it. And you can model for him how to drink from the open cup, and if it gets a little messy, that's okay. Changing your child's routine can be really challenging, but it's easier if you do it a little bit each day to create a new routine, and in the long run, it'll really be worth it.